dear friends welcome to this open education resource on topic planar chromatography this is the video series of planar chromatography in which today currently we just deal with first video that is chromatography introduction chromatography means color writing welcome you all to this color world of chromatography chromatography is a separation method chromatography could be used for both qualitative as well as quantitative purpose qualitative purpose means just the identification of the compound given compound is present or absent in quantitative aspects we proceed further for the quantitation it is a chromatography it is a instrumental method having uh, it is instrumental method having a number of advantages over the previous methodologies of spectroscopy if you just look out what the phenomenon then as it is a chromatography is a separation method previous days filtration evaporation distillation extraction were the methods used for the analysis of mixtures nowadays what the limits of single component methodology that to be overcome by chromatography then what the multi components in a market their analysis not to be carried out by means there are limitations for the modified spectroscopic methods they also to be carried out by chromatography there is a need of separation of component and afterwards their quantification that to be possible by chromatograph separation of impurities separation of degradation products from the bulk active ingredient is possible by chromatograph the basic requirements for the chromatography that mixture must be of molecular dimension it should be in solution or in a vapor state another requirement is that the solute should have relative affinity for the two phases stationary phase and the mobile phase so that the mass transfer occurs easily so to define the chromatography chromatography comprises a group of methods for separating molecular mixture that depend upon the differential affinities of the solute between the two immiscible phases differential affinities of solute for between the two phases immiscible phase, two immiscible phases one is remain stable that is a fixed bed of large surface area of adsorbent material called as a stationary phase whereas the other one which moves through the stationary phase that is called as an mobile phase so when we talk about chromatography separation occur due to the differential affinity of solutes for the stationary phase and the mobile phase just have a look of this video
so what the video we seen is a exam that was an example of a column chromatography stationary phase is embedded in the column the mixture along with the mobile phase transfer and we are achieving the separation depending upon the differential affinities of solute for stationary phase and mobile phase the purposes of chromatography mostly used for the analytical to determine chemical compositions as well as another is a preparative to purify and collect more amount of components the question for assessment in chromatography separation of mixture occurs due to so you have to look out for the correct answer dear friends at the end of this video series in each tab we provided mcqs uh, depending upon the discussions made in video so just go through the video links also to have the assessment for the understanding of the videos for any further uh, fit, uh, clarification or details contact us through the feedback tab our address is given there thanks